Hey, good evening. Um, welcome to In the Upper Room. And this <laughs> evening, I know you guys are saying, is that that stranger? Because I wasn't with you last program. But, uh, you know, thanks to your thoughts, prayers, and uh, all, of the, all of the support, um, you know, God saw fit for me to get back up on my feet. And I thank you all for your support. Again, I'm Michael Riley, and this evening I'm joined by uh, Mr. Maurice Pritchett. He, he's a great part of In the Upper Room. And uh, one other thing I just wanted to mention, uh, you guys noticed that Shauna's not on set, but she wasn't feeling that well. But being the trooper that she is, she is here in the studio, and believe me, you will see her uh, through the course of the program. So thank you once again for tuning in. And this is in the upper room. Doc. Yes. Hey. How are you? Oh, my favorite. Good seeing you here. Good. <laughs> good seeing you too, Yes, Doc. indeedy. What's new? Oh, everything's going well. Just uh, we finished the uh, retirement for my wife. Oh, yes. Excellent program you and Sean have put together. Oh. Uh, BB and all of the committee members, just wonderful. So uh, I'm here tonight, and of course I'm just like being here every day with you because we talk all the time on the phone. So <laughs> I mean, what's new? I know, that's right. <laughs> yeah, it's funny though. Uh, even though we talk all the time on the phone, yes, I still can't keep up with you. No, I don't know no. What do I got to do? What do I have to do? Well, we'll just keep doing what we're doing because I'm with you. You caught me, and we're here together. That's right. That's yeah. Right. Um, and, and you know, Doc, uh, once again, congratulations um, to Mrs. Pritchett and your family. Oh, thank you very retirement. much. Retirement. Thank uh, you. What was that, thank 40 you. years? Yes, yes. 40 years. 40 years, of 40 years of service. On behalf of education. And, and the students still love her. I saw the steppers at the retirement party. Wasn't that wonderful? Oh, man. Outstanding. Outstanding. Yes. AKAs came out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, you know. know with God. the pink and green that's in the right. house. That's right. That's um, right. You know, uh, interesting about that. And, and I'm not sure if I'm supposed to say these kind of things. Go right that. ahead. This, is, this okay. is what we do. All right. But, uh, you know, we mentioned about the uh, AKAs and, and everything. We have another AKA in the house tonight as a guest. Oh, yes, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. My girl Daphne yeah, Evans, Daphne um, Evans yes. who has a, a new book out. While we're on that subject, let's tell them who we got tonight, okay? Okay. All right. Well, we have um, Daphne Evans. She's going to come on come on and talk about her book, I Give You Jesus. Uh, it's awesome, man. I, yeah, I can't wait yeah. to, for her to, to let them know exactly yes. where she's coming from. It's been in the making for a while. Um, we have Leonard Young from DelawareBlack.com. Oh, good. He's, he's here. He's going to talk about the Delaware Black Awards. And as a bonus, he brought with him the host for the uh, 2010 um, Delaware Black Awards. We got um, uh, Brittany Nicole. I hope I got that name right, cause cause I'm all like uh, starstruck. But we also have a um, brother named uh, Reed. Last name Reed. You go, they going they going to introduce themselves. So anyway, yes. I should have wrote it down, but I don't feel too bad because I saw Leonard looking at cue cards when he was on TV. Right? <laughs> so uh, I don't have any. Um, so anyway, um, so uh, do you have any other other opening remarks? Well, you know, I'm just happy to be here this evening, and again, uh, we're we're planning. Uh, some things with uh, the Red Clay School District. Actually, we're going to have a uh, a, uh, a breakfast uh, where the uh, principals of the various uh, elementary schools and the uh, the uh, various politicians yeah. are invited from City Council and uh, uh, City Council at large. Right. We're going to sit down and uh, give them an opportunity to go over their uh, their school plans, mm -hmm. and uh, we're inviting some parents, okay. community. Uh, uh, activists to talk about okay. what we continue, what we can continue to do right. uh, to make those schools great. Hey. So I'm, I'm excited to do that on November the 13th, right. from uh, nine to uh, 12, and it will be at Warner okay. Elementary School. Well, when we come back on a little bit later after break during the show, we're gonna go back and get some more details. All right? Sounds great. For right now, let's go to prayer and, and join me in the throne of grace. At home, please bow your hearts and minds as we go to the throne of grace. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this opportunity to come once again and meet our viewers on In the Upper Room. Lord, although this is a television program, it's about real life, Lord. Um, in real life, there are people out there who need a positive message. 
who need to know that people care about them, that people are interested in them. And Lord, we pray that our audience gets a feeling that they too matter. They too are heroes in this community. It's not all about whether or not they're on television or not. Because somebody out there is going to need your help somewhere along the line. So let's all try to get together and love and serve God with one heart, one mind. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Thank you. So at home, please continue to watch. We will be back with more from In the Upper Room.